Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jennifer. Today we're going to unbox, I'm going to show you an unboxing of this beautiful Rouge Dior Holiday Limited Edition set from Dior. And we're going to try on all the lipsticks that come in it. So, if you want to see that, let's get it. Look how gorgeous this beautiful box arrived in this really pretty white, white packaging. Oh my gosh, this box is gorgeous. I opened the box and I had some gift with purchase products that I wanted to show you because these products were really, really beautiful. Now, I'll list the codes that I used down in the description box below in order to, and they may or may not work anymore, depending, but I do think that, you know, always look for a gift with purchase, like a promo code, so that you are able to get some extra goodies and be able to try some perfumes or sh shades that you may not be, normally be able to try. this particular box in general and why I chose this one instead of the others that are there. So this is the collection set before Rouge Dior. There's three lipsticks and one lip balm in this and it is the Culture Color and Floral Lip Care. I chose this because I don't have any of these shades available and I love the box. As you can see, this box is gorgeous. It is a midnight blue velvet case inspired by Dior's iconic culture canage pattern and it includes a mirror so you are able to use this and kind of use this to keep on your vanity or anything like that. I thought that would be a perfect use for this box. Now it includes three lipsticks and I didn't have any of these lipsticks prior to you know, ordering this particular box and a lip balm which I've never tried their lip balm so I thought hey, if, it might be nice to try and just kind of see how it is. This set retails for $185 and can be found on the Dior website. And like I said, always look for a code if you're interested in buying anything from the Dior website because they always have these codes available online and uh, see if they work because you never know. y'all let's get into trying on these lipsticks lipsticks they're one of my favorites i love a good lipstick and i have not even tried this on so we're going to try them on first first up we're going to try on the lip balm i did scrub my lips for this friends <laughs> but it is i mean i don't know we'll try little bit of a scent to it but not like a ton of scent actually feels very nice on the lips y'all and I love the packaging of this like it's really nice lip balm right it feels good all right I'm gonna take that off all right so this shade I'm really nervous about so this is that 100 shade this is the nude look in matte now this is one of their famous this is one of their famous nude colors. Now, we're going to see how this is. I should do, like, I do have the nude look eyeshadow palette. I should do that. Let's see. 
what this looks like with this on. I'm excited. Okay. I'm rubbing my makeup away on my face. I was like, I should have touched that up. <laughs> Let's see. So it says this is a matte. I don't feel like it's a matte. This doesn't look matte. Right? It feels satin, but it says it's matte. Nude look matte. And I think it's supposed to be that, yeah, it says this is a matte finish, but this does not feel like a matte lipstick at all. It feels like a satin finish. Hmm. Does this look matte to you? Hold on. What you in? I love the shade though. Isn't it pretty? I feel like it's a very good nude for me. But... This is not matte. I might have to call you or ask them. It says matte on the lipstick bullet. There is no way that this is matte. <laughs> okay, let's try on the next one. All right, the next one that we are going to try on is the Rouge Dior Icon Velvet in 720. This is the shade here. Now this looks like the velvet, see? You can kind of see the texture of it around the edge of it. So let's try this on. I probably should have, hold on. And this is a velvet matte. This is shade 720. <laughs> so, Y'all have got to let me know which shades are your favorite because I have to know. And these are all full size, y'all, right? Bringing it in here just a bit. I do have the lip liner, but I do want to try to see how it looks without lip liner first. So let's do 999 right here. I know. I love a good, I love a good red. So this is the classic red from Dior. And it's not mad velvet. Come on. <laughs> this is a matte velvet red. I love it. I mean, it's like an iconic red. I feel like red just... It's one of my favorite shades to wear. It is a little bright, but it's not like cool red. It's not like warm red. It's like, this is your red. Like neutral down the middle. Great shade. I mean, goodness, y'all. Look at this beauty with some great lipsticks. Now, if you pick this up, can y'all tell me if your, what, the new look shade is a matte? Mine is, I don't think it's a matte. This is, this cannot be a matte. It's like a satin finish. Or if you have the Rouge Dior matte lipstick, is it feel like a satin? I don't know. It's not that. Let me know. But anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this and I really appreciate you guys watching. If you're new here, I invite you to subscribe. If you're here and you have not subscribed yet, subscribe down below, click the button, it's free. <laughs> and I really appreciate you guys. I'll leave my latest video right here and I'll see y'all over there. Bye y'all.